Change. Yep, you better. Alright, he's dead. He's already dead. I'm just gonna pop. That's okay. I got my past it. Well, you saw right there one of the reasons why ignite over teleport. I go over to my guy, but I'll be happy to tell you why here again. Basically, the reasons why I usually take ignite over teleport. Um, there are two reasons why I take ignite, and three reasons why I don't take teleport. So normally, the three reasons why you want to take teleport are as follows. One, you take it because you like split pushing, and you use teleport to get back with your team. But Zack's a terrible split pusher. Zack is 100% a team fight. So that's not a good excuse. Another reason is that you want to take teleport so that if you get chunked out in lane, you can teleport back without losing any minions. Early on, which is great. However, Zack, because of his passive, can usually stay at points where most other champions have to back away. Um, thanks to this passive, you can stay under your tower with 10 health and still feel comfortable and safe. Because it's really hard to tower dive Zack early. So you don't need it to get back into lane. Um, and the third reason is to teleport gank bottom. However, um, Zack is a champion who's best from stealth. If you see Zack coming, it's really easy to dodge Elastic Slingshot. Really easy. It's telegraphed, 100%. But if you don't see Zack, well, then it's hard to stop him. And if you teleport bot lane, it's almost always going to be the case that you're going to be 100% visible. Damn. <laughs> Damn, he moved away. So those are the three reasons why I don't take teleport. Now, the two reasons why I take ignite is one, it helps you get kills early. Earlier in the, uh, so far, ignite has helped me get two kills. That's just so far. This game, it has helped me get two kills. Um, actually, maybe three. I think it's helped get me three kills. And getting early kills because you have an ignite or your opponent does not is huge. The other reason is, in team fights, usually your primary target is the AD carry. And I find that if you Elastic Slingshot on top of them, if you Elastic Slingshot on top of the AD carry, and then toss all of your abilities on them, and Ignite, they'll die, 100%. Ignite prevents them from using their heal to heal up and survive, prevents them from life leeching so that they'll survive. Ignite just allows you to 100 to 0 the AD carry. Oh, they surrendered. They have surrender. So that was. those are the reasons why I take um, Ignite over Teleport. You can definitely run Teleport on Zack and be very successful, but I, I don't for those reasons.